Hello guys and obviously I am back making another video and it's going to be back to football related now. The breaking news as I'm speaking um, in the past few minutes, Liverpool and Barcelona have announced that Luis Suarez is leaving Liverpool to go to Barcelona. I just want to give my honest thoughts on it really. Um, uh, thing is, we expected this to happen this summer after his biting incident again but on behalf of Liverpool and Liverpool fans I think this was the best solution for for all of it I mean after the third biting incident I really don't think they could have kept him and he said in a statement that it's always been his dream to play in Spain and um, his family are based there and I think I had him all wrong I really do um, he showed ultimate respect to Liverpool in his statement, which I'll uh, I'll read to you now, if you haven't heard it. I'm sure you have heard it, but I'll read it from my point of view. Uh, it's always sad when a major player leaves your club, it really is. But um, the thing is, the club still remains. Luis Suarez is leaving Liverpool, but Liverpool will still have the fans... We will still support and we will still be loyal to our club. We will always be loyal to our club. It is um, great sadness, really, but he, he is going. Um, yes, he had his flaws, major flaws, but you can't deny he was an absolute genius on the pitch. It was, it was a pleasure, absolute pleasure watching him. It really was. And best of luck to him at Barcelona, obviously. I really hope he doesn't do any controversial now I really do because he's a phenomenal player and um, I really wish him all the best and I'm sure Liverpool fans wish him all the best as well I'll, I'll read his statements in full in a few moments so uh, I'll, it, it, um, I don't know what to say I don't know there's a feeling of gut-wrenching in me right now so um it is, it is gut-wrenching to see a major player leave. We've had it with Torres, we've had it with Suarez now. But trust in Brendan Rodgers. He knows what he's doing, okay? We know. We know he knows what he's doing. So, cheers. Right, as promised, I shall read the statements to you all now. In case you haven't seen them, I'm sure you have. But just in case you haven't, um, Liverpool Football Club today issued the following statement in relation to the future of Luis Suarez. Liverpool FC confirms that Luis Suarez will be leaving the club after a transfer agreement was reached with FC Barcelona. The player now has permission to complete the usual formalities which will then conclude the transfer. We would like to thank Luis for his contribution and the role he played in helping bring in Champions League football back to Anfield. Everyone at Liverpool Football Club wishes Luis and his family well for the future. Um, and I think on behalf of the fans, we'd like to thank him as well. I re really do. And also, we've actually had a statement from the player himself, Luis Suarez. Um, and he said, It is with a heavy heart that I leave Liverpool for a new life and new challenges in Spain. Both me and my family have fallen in love with this club and with the city. But most of all, I have fallen in love with the incredible fans. You have always supported me and we as a family will never forget it. We will always be Liverpool supporters. I hope you can all understand why I have, why I have made, this made this decision. My, the, this club did all they could to get me to stay. By playing and living in Spain where my wife's family live, and I think that's important, family, um, is a long, lifelong dream and, ambi and ambition. I believe now the timing is right. I wish Brandon Rogers and the team well for the future. The club is in great hands and I'm sure it will be successful again next season. I am very proud I have played my part in helping to return Liverpool to the elite of the Premier League and in particular back into the Champions League. Thank you again for some great memories, moments sorry, and memories. You'll never walk alone. Now if you ask me guys, I've always accused him of not having any respect for Liverpool, but with this statement, um, there's ultimate respect right here. And um, 
the, the thing that gets it for me is we will always be Liverpool supporters and playing and living, the club did all they could to get him to stay, but playing and living in Spain, where his wife's family live, is a lifelong dream and ambition. And I think on behalf of every Liverpool fan, I think we can understand this decision now. He's thinking about his family. If his family have given him the go-ahead to make the move, then you can see, um, you can clearly understand. And I think um, the best solution was to let him leave now, to be, to be quite honest with you. And he said, I believe that now the timing was right. I agree. I really agree. The timing was right. Say, if he stayed another year, would he, wor would he be worth his release clause then? Possibly not. Maybe this was the best time to let him go. And uh, I, I fully agree with it. And we will miss him. But um, we will survive without him. That's what I'm saying. And Brendan Rodgers has also issued a statement as well. Um... Louis is a very special talent and I thank him for the role he has played in the team in the past two years during my time at Liverpool. I think he would be the first to accept he has improved as a player over that period along with the team and has benefited from being here as we have benefited from him. The club have done all they can over a sustained period of time to try and keep Louis at Liverpool. It is with great reluctance and following lengthy discussions we have eventually agreed to his wishes to move to Spain for new experiences and challenges. We wish him and his family well. We will always consider them to be friends. We are focused on the future as we strive to continue with the progress we have made to build on last season's excellent Barclays Premier League campaign. I'm confident we will improve the team further and will be stronger with this coming season. When we will be competing on all fronts, domestically and in the greatest club competition in the world, the Champions League. If there is one thing the history of this great club teaches us, it is that Liverpool FC is bigger than any in individual. I hope our supporters continue to dream and believe that we are moving forward and with continued improvement and progression, together we will bring the success we all crave and deserve. And from that statement with Brendan Rodgers here, it gives us ultimate hope. This man knows what he's doing. He said with great reluctance, but he eventually agreed to let him go. And um, my honest thoughts about it, it is sad. It is sad to see a major player go, but it was the best solution to all, right? Um, for us Liverpool fans, he has dragged our name through thick and mud with his biting controversies and his racism thing. But um, uh, uh, I'm willing to overlook them to focus on the phenomenal player that he is. I've been one of his biggest critics, I'll be quite honest with you. I have been nuts about it. And I Last year, when he almost went to Arsenal, I was calling for him to go because... Um, maybe that was the wrong thing to do because he wanted to go for the wrong reasons but this time he's leaving for the right reasons to be quite honest with you and uh, if any Liverpool fans um, and <laughs> it, it, I don't know what to say really uh, it's just um, you can tell by my tone of voice that it is gutting it is gutting to see him leave but we did see this come in and um, uh but he's thinking about his family, that's the only thing. And I, I've, I've written a tweet myself and um, I basically just thanked him for the great memories. He had his flaws, obviously, but he's an absolute genius on the pitch. An absolute genius. We will survive without him, don't worry guys. I've, I've said this quote, I've made up this quote. Um, Players come and go, but we will still support and we will keep believing. Loyalty costs nothing. And what I mean by that is, I'm not talking about the players' loyalty, I'm talking about the fans' loyalty to the club. Whoever stays and whoever goes, this club is bigger than everyone. Personally, thanks to Luis Suarez for the memories we have cherished over the years, these past three years he's been with Liverpool, and um, he's given us some great memories, some beautiful goals, memorable goals and the most important thing I think is we are back in the Champions League because of his contribution. If he didn't if he left last summer 
we would not be in the Champions League. We'll see what this season brings now, but Liverpool fans everywhere, we will still support, we will still believe, we will make a stream again, I'm pretty sure of it, with or without Suarez, and we know it will be without Suarez now. So, to wrap this up, to all Liverpool fans everywhere, you will never walk alone. And while you're at it, check out my other videos as well. I uploaded a video yesterday. It's called Hay Fever is Bullshit. It would mean a lot to me if you could watch that video because I spent a lot of time on that in the editing. And um, I'm just hoping my hard work really pays off because I, I love this. I absolutely love doing YouTube now. Um, I don't care what anybody else thinks, right? I In the past, in the past, I let other people's opinions get to me. I'm not going to let that happen now I'm going for it this is a dream for me to get bigger if you know what I mean I just want to make something out of myself and make a name for myself if you know what I mean so it would mean a lot if you could watch these videos and um, give them the likes give them the comments and maybe give me some followers on Twitter and Instagram as well so one last time thanks Luis Suarez best of luck at Barcelona and on behalf of every Liverpool fan you will never walk alone.